Hello friends, it is a Costco shopping day here in Anchorage, Alaska. It is a beautiful fall day. The trees are turning yellow, there's snow on the tippy tops of the mountains, and it frosted last night. It got cold enough, below freezing, that there was frost on all the grass. So, kind of end of the garden, and back to Costco to fill the refrigerator. I gotta get stuff for the kids' lunches and for dinner this week. Let's get inside. Okay, it's fall outside. It's also fall in here. Halloween costumes behind me. This is something I haven't seen before. Color sugar cookie kit. Four assorted designs, 12 cookies, six food coloring markers for $11.99. That would be a fun activity. About a dollar a cookie. We've got some spooky snacks. $21.59. Oh, they are like Cheetos in the shape of bones. Kind of fun. Reese's pumpkins, $11.79 for a 65 piece bag. Oh, and they've got pumpkins. $10.99 for these jumbo ones. I always buy my pumpkins here, but I don't think I'm ready yet. This is new. You get a box of ornamental pumpkins for $21.99. That's kind of fun. You get seven pumpkins in there for $21.99. This is something I have never seen. This is a local restaurant. Serving Alaska since 1955. Burgers, wings, $79.99 for $100 worth of gift cards. That's new. I haven't been to the Lucky Wishbone since I was a teenager, so I probably need to try it so that I can recommend it or not. Mark likes these boots. Thinsulate 800s for $74.99. I think that's a good deal. I'll have to ask him how much he just paid for his. He just got a new pair but he bought them at Cabela's. If you're new here, my name is Lauren. We live in South Central Alaska, right outside of Anchorage. I'm a mom to four boys. I'm currently pregnant with twins, and I do a lot of Costco shopping. I like to share the prices with you so you can compare them to where you live, show you what we have to offer here in Alaska at our Costco. My husband's actually leaving on a hunting trip this week, so we're really hoping that we get a moose to fill the freezer. And uh, that might reflect in my shopping this week. Easier meals. This mama's tired. I get tired really quickly uh, being pregnant with twins. So I may be buying a few convenience foods. We'll see. It's a good deal on these baskets. You get four. Oh, this one only has three. One, two, three, four. Nope. <laughs> you get four for $17.99. They come in white or gray. I use a lot of those kind of baskets in my home, but I usually get them at Target. I feel like $17.99 for four is a good deal. They have some new KitchenAid mitts. These are like really rubbery silicone. We actually lost one of these. My fabric ones caught on fire in the kitchen last week. So $16.99 for a four piece set. If you didn't see that video, thankfully I caught it really quickly and we were able to take it outside and it didn't cause a big fire, but it's a little bit scary. $7.59 for some liquid dish soap. $17.99 for kitchen bags. I've seen this pink stuff like on Instagram and things, but never seen it here at Costco. Miracle cleaning paste. Tell me down in the comments if this stuff worth it. $15.39 for two tubs. $3.29 for English muffins. You get 10 of them. $6.29 for 30 tortillas, and these are actually made locally here in Anchorage. $8.59 for some bread. Oh. <laughs> I was going to grab this one, but I see another one that's on sale. That one was $10.99, this one's $8.99. This has been a pregnancy craving. 
when I don't feel like eating anything. So I'm gonna grab those. Aussie Bites for $10.99. The boys like to eat these for breakfast or have them in their lunches. I don't know if I've ever seen this brand. They're called Rave Apples, $5.99 or $1.49 a pound. It's a good deal, we're gonna try them. $2.99 for bananas or 99 cents a pound. If you missed it, we don't need potatoes for a little while. We did pick our potato crop. We didn't get nearly as many as we've gotten in the past, but we just felt lucky for what we did get with how the weather was this summer. So we've got potatoes to eat for a little while. $7.99 for grapes. $6.99 for green beans. $9.99 for some mandarin oranges. $11.99 for some peaches. $4.99 for a Costco chicken. Chicken tortilla soup, $8.99. Easy fall meal. My boys are in cross country running, so some nights we need a really quick dinner before we run off to the races. So I'm gonna grab this. like buffalo chicken. <laughs> Got a little bit of a kick to it. Need to start paying attention to when diapers are on sale. So I did a video recently in a small town called Valdez and the diapers were about 50 40 to 50 cents a piece. And somebody asked, how does that compare to Anchorage? So here I'm at Costco, the Kirkland diapers, 22 cents a piece, 27 cents a piece, 20 cents a piece, Huggies, 25 cents a piece. So much cheaper when you buy them in bulk. I still like to wait till they go on sale. Next time they go on sale, I am going to start stocking up for the twins, I promise. Costco is also where I like to buy my baby wipes. $5.79 for sour cream. So our milk right now is $8.59 for 1% for two gallons, $9.19 for 2%, and $9.99 for whole milk buying milk this week because I had to stop by my local grocery store Fred Meyer for some medicine and I happened to walk by the milk and it was $2.99 a gallon so I stocked up at the grocery store so much cheaper than $5 a gallon here I couldn't believe it it was such a good deal The boys really like these in the air fryer, so I'm gonna grab some. $14.69. Five dozen eggs, $13.89. Ooh, they have these very soft little sets. Comes with a sweatshirt, sweatpants, and then on the back has a onesie and a pair of pants. Very cute. Got the cherries, and then they've got this little bear. $15.99 for the four piece set. That's actually a pretty good deal. Starts at three month all the way up to 18 month. Do I get these for the girls? They're really cute. trying to get rid of all summer stuff. There's all these pairs of shorts for like $2.50. Here. There's some more over here. 
making room for all the winter stuff. One of the boys did ask me for shorts, so I'm gonna see if there's any boy shorts. Unfortunately, the men's shorts are not on sale. Two for $19.99, still not a bad price. Um, but I'm gonna keep an eye. If they go down in the next couple weeks, I'll get my money back. $7.59 for Go-Gurts. I don't know if I've ever seen this at Costco before. A two pack of Tostitos Salsa Con Queso, $8.39. Right next to the Velveeta. We love our little rain boots like this, the little cutoff ones. This is a different brand than we usually buy, but this is a much better deal. $34.99. Haven't seen those before. I live in mine all summer, and so do my boys. <laughs> Once they have them, they're like, they're the best. We buy the brand Extra Tough, but those might be worth trying. They've got my favorite women's Crew socks back in stock. This is all I wear year round. I'm wearing them right now. I actually stocked up last year when they were on sale, so but I'm happy to see them back. For a while, they didn't have them. Okay, I knew these hats would go on super sale. $2.97. I love a good sun hat. And some people are like, you don't need a sun hat, you live in Alaska. Uh, we get, not this summer, but we usually get very long hours of sunlight in the summer. $2.97, I'm picking up one. Getting in some slippers for winter. These are very, they have like no structure to them. Plush slipper socks, yeah, they're more like a sock. $9.99. Whereas these have more of a sole, yeah, like a hard sole. These ones are $24.99. Ooh, I missed these at the beginning. They've got this two set of Dutch ovens. You get a 3.5 quart and a 5.5 quart. I love these white ones. And they have this red. Really like this white with the gold lid. Beautiful. $59.99 for the two. I feel like that's a really good deal. Dutch ovens can be very expensive. So pretty. $13.99 for 30 bags of chips. These brownies are on sale, $10.99, so I'm gonna grab a box. My son Bennett loves to make those got three packs of pumpkin. I think I still have some from last year. There was a little while where pumpkin was really hard to find, but $8.79. I have not made anything pumpkin yet this fall. I do have a good pumpkin recipe. A good pumpkin recipe. I have a good pumpkin cookie recipe. Did not finish my sentence. $9.89. Fruit bars for the boys' lunches. I'm gonna grab these for the boys to try. I really liked them when I sampled them a few days ago, or weeks ago, not days. $11.99. This is a new product. Unreal Dark Chocolate Caramel Peanut Nougat Bars. So that would be like, what, kind of compared to a Snickers? I really like their dark chocolate coconut ones. These ones are $10.89. And then these ones are $14.89. Ooh, this is dangerous. This is on sale for $4.89. We just love this stuff. <laughs> Didn't expect to be getting so many candies today, but it's nice to have some things on hand for lunches and snacks. try and follow the rule at home if it's in a package then it's for like putting in a lunch um, if they're home they need fruit veggies things from the refrigerator leftovers go for those they don't eat things that are in a package when we're at home very often Cheers. okay my high-risk doctor said I need to start stocking up on iron so I'm gonna grab these 1049 
$15.59. The boys, these are on sale. The boys are gonna think these are great for their lunches. $10.49 for some coastal berry trail mix. Okay, this is on sale for $13.49 for my house full of boys. Hi, Lloyd. Good, how are you doing? Thank you. I'm gonna grab some backup toothbrushes. These are on sale for $9.99 for an eight pack. This is the first I've seen of the holiday soaps. This is $12.99 for a four pack. I love giving these as gifts with my favorite geometry dish towels to my kids' teachers and friends and things like that because I think they're fun, but I also I love the soap inside of them. Okay, here is our cart for today. We just harvested a bunch of veggies from the garden, luckily before it um, froze last night, so I have lots of lettuce. I've got cauliflower, the rest of the broccoli, rest of the um, some squash, some celery. So I didn't buy as many veggies as I usually do. I'm just holding out another couple of weeks, enjoying the vegetables from our garden. Today has felt very relaxed here at Costco. Not a lot of people. It's been easier to just shop and talk. wanted to try one of these and one of these. This one's full of air. Oops. I actually ran six or seven errands today before I came to Costco. Usually I just come straight to Costco, but I had a bunch of things I needed to do in Anchorage. Whew. So this mama is tired. Let's see, what time is it? It is 2.30, so hopefully I can go home and get a little bit of a rest after putting all the groceries away. All right, a little taste test. Never tried this one. So it's dark chocolate, caramel, peanut butter, nougat. Ooh, it's hot in here. Okay, it said 52 when I went in. Now my car says 70, but I think it's just because it's sitting in the direct sunlight. 68. Yes, this is definitely like a Snickers. I like the size of it though, better. It says 40% less sugar than leading brand. So the dark chocolate coconut is like a Mounds or an Almond Joy without the almond. I already know these ones are good if you like coconut, so. I'll eat that on my drive home. Let's get home, I'll show you the haul and tell you the total. Hello, Miss Luna. She's napping in the sunshine under the table. Hi, sweetheart. How are you? All the groceries are up. Let's do the haul. I was actually counting in my mind as I was bringing up the groceries. I actually stopped at nine different errands or places this morning before I went to Costco. No wonder I'm feeling tired. So I'm gonna show you the haul and then I'm gonna put away anything that needs to be refrigerated, and then I'm gonna get a power nap 
before the boys get home from school and then I'll put the rest away while they're doing after school snack and homework. How does that sound? Okay, chicken tortilla soup, taquitos, just easy meals or after school snacks. Five dozen eggs, sour cream, which unfortunately I dropped and is now all over the rug downstairs. So I will have to go clean that up before I get to take my power nap. A rotisserie chicken. These actually are gonna go together. I'm gonna be making some chicken enchiladas. That's on the plan for this week. Green beans, we've been loving these as a side dish for dinner. And then our fruit section, we got two things of bananas, mandarin oranges, apples, grapes, and peaches. I don't know that we'll be seeing peaches for very much longer, so had to grab some peaches. Then we got our breads. We got our nine grain bread, Dave's killer bread, English muffins, and tortillas. Sweet and salty bars, fruit bars, Aussie bites. This is like, lunch section. They won't be taking all of this every day, obviously. They need to just pick one or two things. My son Bennett has shown interest in taking over making lunches for me as like a bonus chore to earn a little bit of money. So I've been letting him try it out the last couple weeks. He's been making everybody's lunches at night and then has them ready to go in the morning. It's been working pretty well, but he asked me to get more variety so he had more choices of things to put in there. So that is what this is all about. Probiotic strawberry yogis. We did the taste test of these. They're like Snickers bars, almond bars, some trail mix, chips, brownies, Australian licorice, and applesauce. Did we already saved these. Aussie bites and fruit bars. This is all this will get put away in the pantry after my power nap. Miss Luna has not moved from the sun. It's just too nice. I know. It's just too nice. We haven't seen much sunshine lately, have we? Okay, my $2 sun hat, some deodorant, toothbrushes, iron, some shorts, Ultra Joy, because I realized yesterday we were pretty much run out and some kitchen bags. Do you have a guess on what our total is for today? Let me find my receipt. I, I didn't buy a lot of veggies today. I still see tomatoes in front of me. I have a cucumber left, cabbage from the garden, like I said. So it was a low vegetable day, but we still got lots of good veggies to use up. We've been making lots of vegetable chicken soups and things like that. Beef barley soups with lots of vegetables. Our total, $347.05, $347.05. That was our total today. Luna has the right idea. Yeah. I gotta go down and clean up my mess. Pour sour cream. Dr. Luna decided to come see what I was doing, huh? Yeah, cleaning up my mess. That's all I got in me now. Whew. Oh, finally time to relax. Last week I had appointments three days during the week. It was a very busy week. So this week I tried to clump all my appointments into one day so that I could stay home the rest of the week other than, you know, running kids around and Today was that day, I did it, with about 45 minutes to spare for a cat nap. Thanks for watching, friends. We are so grateful for each and every one of you that chooses to spend time with us, and we'll see you again real soon for more of This Alaska Life. It's not really nap time till Miss Luna comes and joins me. <laughs> She's gonna watch over me.